Go. Hi, my name is Aniela de la Cruz. I'm an assistant professor here at the Faculty of Nursing at the University of Calgary. So Aniela, what is it that you do? What's your research about? Well, the title of my program of research is Vulnerability and Capacity Building, Studying the Health and Social Familial and Political Contexts of Immigrant Families Living With or Affected by HIV in Canada. Through this program, I address issues of health inequities experienced by vulnerable immigrant families affected by HIV in Canadian society. Currently, we know very little about the vulnerabilities within this particular population, particularly within the Sub-Saharan African immigrant uh, community. We know very little about families um, who cope with HIV illness as well as settlement experiences. And so my program of research addresses these gaps. What we do know in Alberta is that about 25% to 30% of current HIV cases in our province are non-Canadian born, with the majority being from sub-Saharan African countries. We also know that access to HIV care, treatment and support programs and services continues to be a challenge within this population. And so without further research, African immigrants, families, men, women and children affected by HIV may become more vulnerable and marginalized in Canadian society. Why does the research excite you? What makes it interesting? Um, well, from a rights-based approach, I want to study and articulate factors that place people in vulnerable circumstances and who experience health and social inequities. This means looking at the broader social determinants of health that influence people's well-being and belonging in society. This also means looking at the way uh, public health policy supports people in these circumstances and finding ways to reduce health and social inequities in society, particularly in this population I work with. But I think the most exciting part of my work is working with so many people to make a change in society. I don't work alone in my research. I work with community-based aid service organizations, people living with HIV. I work with other academic researchers, people who are at the um, Alberta HIV clinics, and I also work with policy decision makers at both levels of government, um, who I work with to make change in society and try to develop just programs and policies to support this population. So how will it change the world? Well, I'm committed to conducting research that will provide an understanding of the experiences of people living with HIV, particularly within the immigrant community, um, but also provide information on the social, cultural, and political context that um, uh, people live in and who face challenges to accessing HIV care, treatment, and support programs. So currently I'm studying the experience of HIV testing within the immigration process um, and the impact of such experiences on migration and settlement in um, Canadian society. I think my research will improve the lives of those who are vulnerable in society. Um, quite often we know so much about the solid facts and the scientific facts of health conditions like HIV, but we know relatively little about the experiences, the lived experiences of um, HIV illness in this community as well as the stigma and the challenges experienced by um, families and people living with HIV. So putting my research alongside some of these scientific and solid facts that we know about HIV as a disease, I think, um, will contribute to just development of social and um, health programs and policies, and in the long term to decrease the health inequities that are experienced by these people in this population.